Okay, let's talk about a couple other settings that you need to know about before launching your first Google Classroom quiz via Google Forms. So we created a Chapter 5 quiz in another video, but the problem is when your student logs on, as we set it with the general settings, it looks like this. And this is because it is not set to accept this email that's outside of your domain. It says gmail.com, um, and our domain matches our school name. It's autrytech.edu. So any student logged in, um, which is all of our students because they don't have their own email, they're not going to be able to access that quiz. So you need to make sure that in your settings you're checking things like that so you don't run into that issue. And here's the problem. This, I just unchecked it. It was previously checked. So take that off so it's not restricted only to your Autry Tech and trusted domains. If you want to keep this on, then you can add over here on your Google Admin console for Google Classroom, you can add domains that you trust there. I think it's more simple with all of the students coming in and, in and out, just not to restrict that because the only way they're going to access it is by being logged into the classroom anyway. Um, saved. I can see the quiz. So just make sure you catch those little settings on Google Forms uh, to make sure that your quiz is just how you want it to be.